The second race, first division of the 1998 and 37th annual Simcoe Stakes. Three-year-old Colt gelding trot, and they're off. From the outside, it's King of Trot and Luke Willett striding out to take the lead. At the inside, second Rebel winner and coming out hard is Buzz and Brian. Rock around the clock looks for a tuck-in from fourth. $20 man is the fifth one. Armbro Revolution is going to race from the trailing position. King of Trot, where he has thrived this year in the Ontario Sire Stakes. On the front end, into the first turn by a length, length and a quarter. Buzz and Brian is out there into the first turn, looking to work into the pocket. Rebel winner back in third. The opening split in a brisk 27 and 2. That's King of Trot, the leader by two lengths into the backstretch. Buzz and Brian did get away in second after parking into the first turn. Racing in from third is Rebel winner at 3 8 completion. Rock around the clock looks at it from fourth. $20 man is the fifth one. And Ombro Revolution continues in the trailing slot. It's King of Trot getting the second quarter respect up front. He's the leader at the half. Buzz and Brian next in line over Rebel winner and Rock around the clock. Then it's back to $20 man starting up in the outside and Ombro Revolution trailed 56 and 4 the halftime 29 and 2 in the second King of Trot the leader moving to the far turn Buzz and Brian along in second looking at it from third is Rebel winner no outside moves just yet Rock around the clock is considering coming out and he's going to flush the cover of Rebel winner to the outside in between trotters $20 man along the inside and Ombro Revolution is trailing they've still got a chore to catch King of Trot to the top of the stretch Rebel winner is trying to draw the beat on that one. 127, they pass three quarters. A more moderate third of 30 and one fifths. And down the stretch in the first Simcoe Stakes Division of 1998, King of Trot has been superb on the front end. Now from a following trip, taking his shot on the outside is Rock around the clock. But Luke Willett sits frozen in the bike. No urging for King of Trot. He's gone wire to wire to win in the Simcoe Stakes. Rock around the clock second. Rebel winner third. 156 and one. Stakes record. King of Trot in the second. King Kong three-year-old Bay Gelding from Cloverleaf Cosmos, owned by Ron Durand of Port Dover, Ontario, trained by Tom Durand and driven to victory by Luke Ouellette. For King of Trot of victory in the 1998 Grand Circuit, Simcoe Stakes, it's his ninth win in 13 starts this year. Also a winner twice in Ontario Sire Stakes Gold Finals here at Woodbine on June 20th and July 25th, and here on September 11th in the Simcoe Stakes. King of Trot in 156-1, and one, fastest three-year-old Coulter Gelding Trot Mile in the 37-year history of the Simcoe Grand Circuit Stakes. Making the winner's enclosure presentation, Fred Walker from CFRB Sports. Simco stakes tonight a record time with King of Trot prevailing, a horse that we see all the time in the Ontario Sire Stakes program. And tonight he's a Grand Circuit winner. Congratulations, first of all, to winning trainer Tom Durand. Uh, Sideline tonight, uh, you gave up the lines to this man. He's been the hottest man in North America this season. Uh, King of Trot, you have to be impressed with him tonight, Tom. Well, I'm very impressed. Um, I, I put Luke up. I have uh, the utmost confidence in him and uh, just want to let some of the other guys have a little fun too. He's got a full slate of OSS races still to come, of course, this summer. Last week against the older horses, he uh, raced differently from off the pace. Yeah, I didn't want to get in any uh, kind of a front-end battle uh, in with the older horses because the younger horses will usually come out with the short end of the stick, so I just kind of took it easy with him, and I thought he raced quite respectably. Where's the next destination for your colt? Um, there's an OSSA at London in about uh, two or three weeks. Okay, we'll get a couple comments here quickly from Luke. Well, that Luke, you never drove the colt before. Did you get any kind of instructions going in? Yes, uh, Tommy was telling me, uh, telling me all about him before the race, kind of advertise how he is, and... Like he said, uh, I did have a little fun out there, too. Yeah, wire-to-wire, -wire, track record time, and uh, you said he had lots of horse left at the end. We pick it up here on the closed-circuit monitors. Colt Strong coming to the finish. Well, uh, he had kind of a nice breed of the third quarter, and uh, he was well in hand, you know. Uh, I didn't have to let him trot any more than he had to, just in case of any mistakes or anything like that, but it wasn't going to be the case. He was just in hand, and, you know, that was enough for tonight. Okay, so congratulations in order here tonight to the crew of the King of Trot, the King of the Ontario Sire Stakes program this year. Congratulations to winning trainer Tom Durand and, of course, winning driver Luke Willett, who's got a big night still to come, of course, aboard drives in the Canadian Pacing Derby and the Roses are Red. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thanks a lot.